Good morning, or actually good afternoon. Um, it is now 12.03 here. Uh, we have a kind of hectic start to this morning. Um, first, set the alarm for 7 a.m., woke up at 10. Um, then I spent the next two hours um, correcting some mistakes, a uh, mistake I made, which made the uh, the videos that were uploading last night that I showed you in the vlog uh, made them useless. So fix the mistakes. Um, I'm re-rendering now. We're just getting ready to head out. Gonna go see some stuff. Um, we're not, I'm obviously gonna bring you guys along, and it's gonna be a good day. It's hot. It's sunny out. Uh, you can't really see the tower from here. I'm kind of behind a tree. I was going to show you the Eiffel Tower again, but I think you get the point. We're pretty close. Uh, Alright, catch you soon. Hello. You join us after our very, very, very late breakfast. Brunch. Brunch. Lunch. Who Dinner knows? At, uh, at a really cool <laughs> little cafe on the corner. Pretty nice. Um... But yeah, now we are en route to Eiffel Tower, and we'll be there shortly, and you'll see it. And isn't she so pretty? Stop. Such a cutie. Stop. Stop it. What? Stop it. Alright, well, she's camera shy. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll catch up with you soon. Bye-bye. Oh, look, there it is. All right, bye. We have made it. Pretty close. Almost there. Okay, you can see it there, peeking, peeking away. And it's gone. And there it is again. It's a beautiful Eiffel Tower. So we made it to the Eiffel Tower. Up close and personal. It's real cool. It's a lot of people, tons of people here. So I'll catch up with you guys somewhere with less people. So I don't even know if you can hear me right now. <clears throat> I'm just gonna take a few pictures uh, and some things for Instagram and Snapchat. And um, we'll head out to the next location. I don't know how to say it in French. <laughs> We're at a museum. I'll get you the name in a second. Museum du Fort Bramley. Museum du Fort Bramley. 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 Museum du Fort Bramley. We're walking to the Arc de Triomphe and we found another market. Europe is just full of markets everywhere. The street just keeps going on and on for markets. With markets. So nice clothes. Ingrid is always shopping for dresses because it's going to be hot. Hey, we made it to the Arc. Oh, we're crossing. A ton of people again. Jeez. 
Uh, here you go. I'll show you a picture. Uh, we're gonna try to stand in the middle of the road. Oh, let's go this way. And ooh, basically, let's see if I can get you another view. No, two cars. All right, there's a bunch of cars, but I'll show you in a minute. We're in the middle of the road, taking a picture in front of the Ark, front and center. Some traffic, well, the lights right now, but. We're pretty much up next. And this kid's about to get run over. So we just took our pictures in front of the, well, that girl standing right there in front of the Arc de Triomphe. And um, next, I don't know what the next stop is actually. Ingrid kind of set everything up for today. So I don't know. But. It's actually pretty dangerous. We're just like in the middle of the street, hoping not to get run over. Alright, well, I'm going to go. Hey everyone, you joining me here at the Petite Palace. By Petite. Uh, it's still giantly massive. It's just like one hall. I think it's a museum. I hope you can hear me. I can't be too loud here, but. Um, just that, that's, you might, you guys might like to see that. Uh, and across the street, we were just there actually, I didn't walk it, but there's the Grand Palace. This guy's the petite one, and that's the grand one. That's much bigger than that, but yeah. And they have a nice interior courtyard over there. I'm just gonna kind of browse around, and then we keep going. All right. Well. All right. I'll see you guys later. We're leaving the Petite Palace. And uh I'll show you the the Grand Palace next. It's right here. That's the that's the Grand Palace. Then we're gonna go walk that way to uh, it's like the Hotel de los Invalids or something like that. Hopefully you can hear me. It's a little windy, but let's roll. I, I don't know if you can hear me, but that's where we came from. The Grand is over there, and the Petite Palace is over there. Ingrid's over there. You see the Eiffel down there. And where we're going. Um, hey man, get no. We are now en route to. We're here, Palace de la Concorde, which is that obelisk. Over there, you can see. The Grand Palace. Over there, you can see Notre Dame somewhere. And behind me, you can see the what I think is the National Assembly Building. See how once again, we're here at the Louvre. It's amazing thus far. Gonna, yep, yeah, sorry. Gonna take a few pictures with Ingrid. And keep moving. All right, chill. Hello, hello. It's now 7.30. 
on what has been a very long day. We made a shopping break at Forever 21 because it's so hot here and it's gonna be so hot in Spain, we need shorts. Because Ireland and Scotland were not that hot. So we weren't gonna bring warm stuff. Anyway, we bought shorts and t-shirts and things for hot weather. We didn't buy sandals, I need a sandal, flip flops. Anyway, we skipped Pompidou, here, go in front. Tons of people. We skipped Pompidou and now we are going to um, Notre Dame and some other things because it's on the way home. And just like that, we're back. There's Notre Dame. That's not it. Is. That is it. I can tell you. I'm sure. And even though it's 7:30, there's still a ton of people here. So I'm just gonna say goodbye. I'll take a bunch of pictures, and I will catch up with you very, very soon.